Good afternoon. The chief of the Pagani First Nation says she will not resign despite an ultimatum handed down by the 12 ban councillors. The council is giving Chief Gale strikes with a gun until next week to voluntarily hand in her resignation. They say if she doesn't quit, they'll take steps to have her removed from office. Strikes with a gun, who has been suspended twice in the past three months, spoke to reporters today and leveled a stinging attack on banned counsel. Terry Vote reports. As chief, I have a responsibility to the Bikani people. Chief Gale strikes with a gun spoke to reporters, but her comments were clearly directed toward members of the Bikani Nation. That it was you, the Bikani Nation people, that elected me to be your chief in January 2011. I was not elected, not elected by the 12 council members. Therefore, there is no basis for the Bikani Council to ask me to resign. The band council is demanding strikes with a gun step down voluntarily, or they say they will take steps under the election bylaw to have her removed from office. Acting Chief Fabian North Pagan says council has given strikes with a gun until 1 p.m. December 14th to make her decision. What we would like to say is if she'll humble herself, swallow her pride, go to her camp and to her family, and heal those wounds that she caused, not us, and be a chief and come and humbly submit her resignation. We'll allow her to seek a vote of approval by the people. And she will be eligible to run to seek that approval. But council says if they're forced to act under the election bylaw, then strikes with a gun would be ineligible to run in a by-election. Council first suspended the chief in September, alleging disagreement over the Begani Investment Corporation and a conflict of interest over the banned taxi agreement. Strikes with a gun denies any wrongdoing and raised questions about the system used by councillors, managers and some banned employees. It's a scratch my back and I'll scratch yours. That system does not work. With the present council protecting their relatives' positions and jobs, the council do not care that certain band members are operating in deficits under their family's management. Chief strikes with a gun contends neither of the suspensions are valid. She's planning to return to work December 19th. In the meantime, she's hired a lawyer but says she can't comment on legal aspects of the case at this time. Terry Vogt, CTV News, on the Begunny Nation. A group of Begunny band members are meeting tonight to raise awareness about some of the major issues facing the tribe. Organizers say they're seeking answers about the Begani Investment Corporation, the custom election bylaw, and the Christmas per capita distribution to band members. They also are circulating a petition calling for the reinstatement of Chief Gale strikes with a gun and by-election to replace band council. We have been... Um very, very upset about what has been going on with the settlement agreement and the monies that are missing and the, and the motions that are they're passing through. Now the meeting is being held at the Begani Nation Community Hall. It was scheduled to start just a few minutes ago. Band councillors say they will not be attending but are willing to set up a meeting with the protesters.